So I was uh, reading the book of Revelation here and I was just thinking, you know, imagining what uh, some of these creatures that are described in the book of Revelation would actually look like. And, you know, so when we go to the book of Revelation, we read the scriptures where God begins to judge the world and realize, uh, you know, how the, um, the story unfolds, right? Because this is actually going to happen. And so the first thing that you see is the, the seals are revealed. And that's just basically an overall description of how things are going to turn out through the course of the tribulation, then the trumpets. So, when we get to the uh, fifth trumpet, right before the fifth trumpet, you know, an, an, an angel exclaims with a loud voice in uh, Revelation 8, uh, 13, and it says, uh, Woe, woe, woe to the inhabitants of the earth by reason of the other voices of the trumpets, trumpet of the three angels, which are yet to sound. So we see that what is coming next is basically a war unto the inhabitants, not only an attack on the vegetation and the plants and the trees and, you know, the non, um, the non-conscious things of the earth, but now it's an attack on the humans themselves. For them to repent and so when you continue on it says uh, in uh, Revelation 9 chapter uh, Revelation chapter 1 uh, chapter 9 verse 1 it says and the fifth angel sounded and I saw a star fall from heaven and to the earth and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit and he opened the bottomless pit and there arose a smoke out of the pit as the smoke of a great furnace and the sun and the air were darkened by reason of the smoke of the pit and there came out of the smoke locusts upon the earth and unto them was given power as the scorpions of the earth have power and it was commanded them that they should not hurt the grass of the earth neither any green thing, neither any tree, but only those men which have not the seal of God in their foreheads. And to them it was given that they should not kill them, but that they should be tormented five months. And their torment was as the torment of a scorpion, when he striketh a man. And in those days shall men seek death and shall not find it and shall desire to die and sh and death shall flee from them and the shapes of the locusts were like unto horses prepared unto battle and on their heads were as it were crowns like gold and their faces their faces were as the faces of men and their hair as the hair of women, and their teeth were the teeth of lions, and they were they had breastplates as it were breastplates of iron, and the sound of their wings was as the sound of chariots of many horses running to battle, and they had tails like unto scorpions and they were they were stings in their tails and their power was to hurt men five months and they had the king over them which is the angel of the bottomless pit whose name in the hebrew tongue is abaddon but in the greek tongue has his name apollyon and so, yeah, so we see this description of this, these locusts, and that's basically what I'm going to um, share with you here. I'm just going to visually make a visual representation of what these locusts will be looking like. It's like really grisly, scary creatures. They've got the tail of a scorpion, and I, I bet this thing is going to be really stinging, right? 
says that it's going to be really sting and people will desire to die but death will flee from them and they have this form of a locust so you know just uh looking at i was just imagining how their legs would look like their limbs will look like scorpions and you know like just like the basic the, the basic uh sorry not a scorpion the locust that we know right right and the wings too just kind of like because these things are coming from the pit so they probably have these wings that are kind of scary and just really cryptic looking things as you can describe in the word of god so it's just really interesting how these things are described and they have the bracelet of an iron the bracelet of iron that's probably to protect them because i think that they were going to be some resistance to towards this thing just imagine how this thing is going to just make the governments go crazy and they'll be there trying to fight back and it's just wow now the shape of these locusts is just really it's um it's just it's crazy the, the description is just really weird because we have the faces of the face of a man and you have this thing is uh it's it, it has the form of a horse a horse so it's it's like uh even the wings are you know are flapping around like like a horse like horses but on chariots it says right so it's just really amusing that you know such creatures are going to come out of the pit and be actually begin to terrorize humans and so these things i'm going to make a follow-up in um to this video and it's going to be uh, just an expanded image uh, of this this is just to give us an idea of what these locusts are going to look like so um yeah so i just think it's interesting for us to just reflect uh you know add fully visually on the things that are going to start happening because uh you know as, as you know for those that, you, that are aware you've seen the signs of the times and it's they're definitely pointing to scenarios where people will see these things actually come to fruition and they'll be looking at these things and wondering wow so the word of god is actually true you know because uh a lot of people have lack of faith and it's this type of thing that just makes you be like wow i never thought i would actually see this type of thing you know, this is just crazy this is the kind of things that you see in the movies you know so we could actually be seeing these things in real life and you go like oh my god what did i just see so yeah i'll just make a follow up on this video so keep uh tuned to this channel please subscribe and uh like this video thank you very much for watching god bless you